Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be talking about C++ Smart Pointer, specifically Unique Pointer. Definition. In computer science, a smart pointer is an abstract data type that simulates a pointer while providing added features such as automatic memory management or bounds checking. Such features are intended to reduce bugs caused by the misuse of pointers while retaining efficiency. Definition obtained from Wikipedia. Unique pointer is a smart pointer that owns and manage, manages another object through a pointer and disposes of that object when the unique pointer goes out of scope. Lesson. I will demonstrate how to use unique pointer without the need of using delete function to deallocate memory. Okay, so let's jump into Eclipse and then demonstrate uh, what we can do with uh, smart pointer specifically unique pointer okay so the first thing I'm going to de declare is include <coughs> memory which is for unique pointer then I'm going to include mem map okay and then include IO stream for standard input output. Then declaring using namespace standard. I'm going to go ahead and create um, two classes. So the first class is called utility. I'm going to declare a map and map table it's going to be string mat map with a double so i call this table okay these are the functions i'm going to declare public um, void say string And this is going to do a regular standard out. My next method or function, I'm going to do a store. So I'm going to store a key and value to the map table. So string key double double value. And it's going to be table string key equal to double value okay my next uh, function it's going to return the value from the table um, so it's going to it's going to be get value passing in the key it's going to return table string key then I want to also declare the actual constructor which we I, I call ctor so utility okay and in order for unique point to the work we need the curly brackets here uh, open curly and close curly semicolon okay and then the destructor which is basically follow um, precedes with a uh, tilde and I'm gonna just message out saying um, in utility destructor End line. <clears throat> okay, so this is the first class that I just created called utility. Okay, then I'm going to go ahead and create another class. And I'm going to create a class called, let's say, my class. and 
these will be my uh, public uh, functions that I'm, I'm going to be declaring. But first off, I'm going to create the CTOR. And the CTOR will be my class. Okay, so my class, I'm going to go ahead and create a uh, um, factory of unique pointer. So um, before that, I have private. I'm going to create a private variable called unique pointer and I'm going to point to the utility utility class that I'm using up here. And I'm going to call this factory. Okay, it's a private variable. So in my constructor, um, this is where I'm going to create uh, and return a unique pointer. So to to utility so standard make unique utility okay and <clears throat> okay and then my next one um, is my destructor so destructor will be my class I'm going to do C out in my class destructor. Okay, let's compile this. No, not, not yet. I, I need to do a couple more things. Then um, I'll go ahead and create. Uh, another um, function void let's say do something and in this case I'm going to call the factory uh, object and then do a say let's say uh, say string okay then in my uh, okay then the next method I'm gonna create is um, get data which I'm gonna return a double so it's gonna do a return factory get value and then um, the key that was passed so technically when uh, we call the method get data from my class, it's gonna basically call um, get value, which is from um, the class utility. Okay, then I'll I'll do a next one. Uh, the me next method we call it. Um, void store data and I'm going to pass it a double and um, in this function we're just going to do a factory store pass in the key and the actual value Okay, so that's basically uh, the class that we created for my class. Okay, let's save it. Um, this should be lowercase. 
Okay. Okay, so now I'm go let's go into the main met method. The main method um, first off I'm gonna create the normal way of doing things, um, which is gonna create a new class and then uh, use delete to basically delete the pointer. So my class star pointer equal to new my class. Okay, and then I, I'm gonna go uh, and uh, call the method called do something. Okay, and I'm gonna say I'm gonna pass in a string hello world, <clears throat> and I'm gonna do store uh, store data. And let's say pi is set to 3.14159. Then I'm going to try to retrieve it. I'm going to retrieve pi from the table. So ptr uh, get data and it's going to be pi end line okay so let's save this and compile okay compile successfully so let's open the terminal CD to debug folder and type in demo as you can see the result here is hello world and Pi is set to 3.1159, which is correct. But but here's the problem. I created a uh, pointer here to my class, but I didn't delete it. Right. So uh, if I forget to delete it, I have a memory leak. Okay. So in order for me, uh, that's why uh, you. you didn't see uh, the message in my class destructor uh, is being sent out right so in, in both cases the utility uh, destructor was in call or uh, the uh, destructor in my class uh, was even call so we have an actual memory leak so um, to fix this problem, of course, is uh, you basically have to manage your own. You have to do delete uh, pointer and let's uh, let's go and save it and recompile. Okay. So yeah. So now now the destructors call and utility destructors call and um, pretty much you know it's deleted from the system but if somebody forget to do this um, you have a memory leak okay so I'm gonna show you how to get rid of this problem by using unique pointer so so instead of doing delete pointer and creating this uh, pointer from above we uh, we substitute this for uh, unique pointer so unique pointer my class pointer new my class okay and uh, let's save this and recompile and let's go back to our terminal and execute the program so as you can see, um, you know, we we uh, see hello world, we see pi, and then right at the end, it uh, called the actual destructor for my class, and um, the destructor in utility. So it actually does the uh, automatically uh, uh, clean up for us without us calling. Um, 
without us have to call uh, delete pointer okay so this is actually a uh, a quick tutorial of how uh, you can use unique pointer to um, do your automatic memory cleanup so um, if you like this video uh, please subscribe to my channel I will create more videos to come thank you very much for watching